We've all heard incredible stories of how animals have changed the lives of so many families and different people, especially one here in Colorado, physically and emotionally. The Stray tells the true story of a dog named Pluto who saves a struggling family in more ways than one after he showed up at their house one day. The movie is based on a Colorado family story. Director and producer Mitch Davis sat down with us earlier in the week. That's our new stray dog. Pluto came into our life kind of uh, by happenstance. We were living in Los Angeles, uh, living a crazy life. I was working at, at Disney Studios, and uh, our family was out of control, and we knew we needed something. So I suggested to my wife that we ought to maybe get a dog, which she thought was the dumbest idea she'd ever heard. Um, and, but she made the comment, she said, tell you what, if a stray dog shows up, I'll think about it. No way am I going to go get a dog on purpose. And then uh, a couple weeks later, this stray dog show, uh, shows up at our house, followed our, our oldest son home from school, and we got the stray dog we didn't really want, uh, but we really, really needed. I just don't understand how they can expect you to work day and night. No, they don't expect, they just assume. I just feel like you're starting to become a stranger and you're... What in the world? Hi. What's wrong? Michelle? We call him Pluto the Wonder Dog because we never really knew where he came from. Uh, he kind of helped us as a family slow down, stop and take a look around and realize what we were missing. Hang on a second. Who are you? That's Pluto. That's our new stray dog. We used to lie in bed at night with the Atlas at the end of every day and just say, what about here? What about there? And our finger landed on Colorado. And we just decided to come here and try to make a new start for our family and make a new start for my career. So why not take a look now? Left my we found a couple of boys in our neighborhood about the same age as our oldest son, Christian. And we headed off into the mountains outside of Fair Play. Between Fair Play and Leadville, there's a place called Ptarmigan Peak and 12 Mile Lake. Um, we headed up there to do some fishing. And uh, before we got to the lake, got into a weird snowstorm. Um, it was July in the afternoon, and I worried that we might get a freak blizzard or something so I put the boys inside the tent and got them in their sleeping bags and started fixing them some hot chocolate and that's when we were hit by lightning. Come on Pluto! What's wrong? Uh, it was a very traumatic situation and uh, those three little nine-year-old boys uh, were were in a serious uh, situation. I didn't know if I was going to live or not. Our youngest son, Parker, uh, he grew up hearing these stories uh -huh. and all of a sudden it occurred to him that they'd make a great movie. It is a movie for families, um, all three generations. And what do we want people to take away? I guess uh, hope. Hope and, and uh, love and enthusiasm for our families. It's so hard when you have a young family, which is what this movie is about. It's about a period of our life that was extremely hectic, um, extremely stressful, but we got through it. And we got through it with the help of a stray dog, and we got through it with the help of, of God and, and our family. You're awfully small, aren't we, boy? Or maybe we're just a part of something awfully big. The movie happened in Colorado, Franktown, Colorado, and Fair Play, Colorado, and the mountains surrounding both of those places. It's an absolutely true story. Um, there are differing opinions in our family as to which version of the story is exactly correct, but it's it's uh, we didn't make this up. It's, it's really all, it's all true. We really hope people from Colorado will embrace the movie because it's a Colorado story.
Well, that is a must. The Stray opens in all theaters this Friday, October 6th. For more information, please visit their website, thestray.movie. You can also buy your tickets to the movie in advance online at fandago.com or movietickets.com. What a great story.